Hiya students, in this video we're looking at um, doing calculations with GST. Now, um, in New Zealand, the GST rate is 15%. Uh, it hasn't always been 15%. Um, they changed it maybe 5 or 10 years ago. Um, and it could change again. Um, but at the moment it's 15%. So um, GST is just a tax that's put on top of anything that you um, buy. And if you're in a business, you have to put GST on um, anything that you sell. So here a plumber charges $238 excluding GST for a job. So the first question is asking us to calculate the GST. So that's just asking what is 15% of 285, so we, sorry 238. So we go 238 times 0 0.15 for 15%. Then we get our calculator out. And we have 238 times 0.15, and so that's $37.70. $37.70. Um, so question B, calculate the GST inclusive charge. Well, there's two ways to do that. One way is to, just to go to the original charge and add on the GST amount. And so that would be, um, we'll just go plus 238, so 273.7. 273.70. So that's one way to do it. Another way to do it is to take 238 and times it by 1.15. And that does it all in one calculation. So I'll show you um, that it gives you the same answer. So 238 times 1.15. And that also gives us 273.7. So 273.70. So both of those ways are valid. This way is a bit faster, um, but yeah, hopefully you understand that the one is just keeping the 238 and the 0.15 is adding the 15%. Okay, one more example very quickly. Um, a TV set is advertised for sale at $17.99, um, including GST. How much of this is GST? So this amount has GST in it already. So um, this isn't quite... Um, as straightforward as you might think. I think a lot of you would probably jump in and go 799 times 0 0.15, but that won't work because this amount already has GST in it. What we have to do is work out what it was before GST. So we go 1799 and we divide it by 1.15. So when you're going backwards with GST, you divide by 1.15. So let's um, do that calculation. So 1799 divided by 1.15. So that gives us 156.35. So that's your amount before GST, but the question is asking how much of it is GST. So we still have to go 1799 minus 1564. 0.35, so we'll go 1799, 1799 minus our answer, so that gives us 234.65, 234.65, and so that's our GST component. So when you have an amount with GST in it already, you just have to be really careful. Okay, so um, with that in mind, have a go at exercise 4.09 please.